What's up guys and welcome back to Technopolis with me Link to Killer Chillin. I think I say that every time. But yeah, I've been doing some work. It's actually pretty easy now that we have a refined storage system now, to be honest with you. Uh, so things I've done between the episodes. All our chest and stuff we had over here. All in the reply, the refined storage system. I do need to rebuild the street inside the dome. Relocate the cows. Um, do something with this. I don't even know if we need this anymore, to be honest with you. Um, so I'll probably just get rid of that. Um, this, I don't have nothing planned for this just yet. Probably still need cobble, so I've just been doing this until I figure out how I want to handle that. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo, what else did I do? I cleaned up here a little bit, so I moved all our drawers up here and stacked them, so now they're nice and neat. And I'm just gonna throw that in there because we'll just use them when we use them. Um, where is the little controller thing? So I went ahead and made another one of these because you did have to use this to turn in a quest. Uh, you have to craft this into another thing, turn it in for a quest. And I made an external storage with my uh, priority set to 10. It actually worked. I logged into the game, did not have to break it and place it. So that works. I also set up the stone miner collecting stone. So now we're getting free stone, don't have to cook down cobble and stuff. Went ahead and made another tier 3 miner. So now all three of these are being processed. I just don't know how I'm going to do this just yet. I really don't know how I'm going to do that. Uh, I moved our coke ovens here to down here. Well, I only moved one. And I have imports and exports. And then I have it all exported into here which is the Creosaur Oil Crafter there. And then all the crystal stuff and lapis are all going straight into the drawer. I made two more magma generators just so we have extra power. I've been flying around to craft all of the things as you can see. Let's see what else. I also crafted more drives. I need one more, and then this one's full, and then we can make another one. Went ahead and made the pattern grid. I think, in a nutshell, that's it. Like, I did all the processing of the ores we needed. Well, that we have back ordered, so that's done. I got the hiccups a little bit. Okay. But other than that, I think that's it. It's just a lot of flying around. Oh, and I did a lot of quests. I was looking to see what all we had to do for that. But now this tier is done. This tier is done. This one here, we do need to waste our advanced technolium ingots. But I think I'm just going to buy these with tech dollars because you can. And then these two here, we actually need to spin them, which I was like, ah, that's a waste right now. Those are kind of hard to come by. I'm not going to waste my stuff. So, so technically we have up to tier one completely done. Um, this one right here, I'm actually kind of working on slowly, of course. But today I want to see how far we can push our limits to get into Technium and get auto-crafted. Um, it's, it's going to be a lot of work. I'm not even going to joke. It's going to be a lot of work, but I think we can do it. So let's see what all we can do. So to do this, we need a resource combiner uh, with water. So we're just going to use the one we have set up over there. It already has power, it already has water, it is already a thun. Uh, next thing we need to do is sear bricks. We need to autocraft those. We have stone, we have to autocraft bronze, autocraft, treat it, and then this is just inputs. Super simple, super, 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 super simple. 
Uh, do I have any patterns made? I ain't even make patterns yet. So I should just tell you right there. So the first thing we're gonna do is make a pattern. And I forgot you can't do that in there. So we're just gonna do that, okay? Uh, next thing we're gonna need is a crafter which I think I have most of this semi-made for us. Uh, netherite crafter. There it is. Okay, so we need you, which we're gonna try to do a couple of them. Okay, that's fine. Now, how hard is it to upgrade this thing? Oh. Okay. Well, I am fine with iron. Iron is probably pretty good. I think it holds like double of a regular one, I think. I may be wrong on that one. Y'all can fact check me. Um, boom. On mine. Boom. Maybe it was three times more. I'm not too sure. Okay, so now we should technically be able to craft these. The only problem is we're going to be short on this. So these should show up pretty quickly. Yeah. Cool. And we can do that. Perfect. Um, I guess now it's just trying to figure out all we have to do. So we need to craft you. Another one of you, which sweet. So I used all of our stuff. We're a little short on the quartz because I just been smelting it like a madman. Which is probably not smart by me, but we we gotta get the stuff done, you know. Alright, so not all of those are locked. A little hiccups, little hiccups, like I do in my Minecraft games. I don't know why. Got memory set to like ten gigabytes. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure why I get the little hiccups, but I do. I do. All right, I'm gonna chuck you in there, and that's gonna just craft up some of this goodness. Um, choo, 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 choo. all right, so we're going to need the induction smelter, which I think I already removed. Because I was trying to clean up, but then I was like, uh, I better tranquilo a little bit. Let's just simmer down. So here's our induction smelter. And I believe you can input and output at the same side. And I think you can just pipe right into them to go into the system. Or maybe that's apply and logistics I'm thinking of. I'm not too sure. But we'll get some of those crafted up. Um, so technically we need to do one, two, three. We can do these, but we're gonna need a smelter of some sorts. So we need four crafters. One, two, three, and then four. Yeah, we're gonna need four crafters, holy smokes. We're gonna be cutting it close, that is for sure. So let's just experiment right now cool that actually worked that's fine just watch it like are you gonna hit the lava hit it so i've got the cables cables were that's where all the quartz went into to be honest with you uh the cables all the way over there yeah <laughs> goodbye <laughs> good 
Goodbye. Me and my trying to keep this all clean looking. I don't even know if I want to do it this way. But that should be online now. And I think during the daytime, this is enough power to run out a system or a refined system until we start adding all these machines and stuff. All right. So processing will be you. Correct. So now, if we need bronze, kind of curious to see this thing work. And I'll put it at perfect. So this is going to work. Now I'm kind of curious if it's going to go back in here or do I need to do some kind of import bus? I might have to do an import bus. I'm not too sure. I couldn't remember. So seeing how it's sitting in here, I'm guessing we're going to have to do output. Because I, I forget which one it is. I think applied you can do that, but on this one you can't, I think. So we're going to need to import import which is perfectly fine we have the resources right now so do that I forgot to grab a cable and then that should input in there and we should see four in here yeah, cool. All right, so that is bronze done. Cool. So next we're gonna need, want this recipe, but I want this recipe. <laughs> and then we're gonna need you. This, this whole system I have here, so Caddy Wonkus. Um, sure. Oh, that's my lava tank. Do that, and we can do that, or we can just do. Heck yeah. Save. Save some cables. Let me just go like that. Okay, so we're going to input, output, auto, auto. Perfect. So now. We're gonna need another one of you. I kinda had to like take my time with this because if not, we're gonna run out of stuff. Ooh, we need so much. We need diamond, which I have those. But that quartz, man. That quartz is killing us. So, we did something like that. Like that. And then we just do that. What about Electrium gear? Neat. And I'm actually going to 
add you to the list over here, just so I don't have to keep flickering through things. And you just used up all my uh, stuff, Chief. that what do we look like on quartz 12 more and yeah we're all the way out crap uh, yeah and we don't have course to even fill that thing up that's pretty bad super expensive like a lot of quartz that go into this. Alright, so why are we got a thing right here? Done. Cool. So we got most of this. This is just wireless. I'm not too worried about that because you need ender pearls to do that typically. And I don't have any. So I'm just throw two of those in there. There, throw those in there, get another crafter. That is not the correct way. But if you remember, they made us make this wrench. Uh, importer. Boop. Uh, smelt that up. Right, and then that can go into the crafter because that's just like regular crafter crafting recipe. Ooh. All right, so now we have two pieces of the puzzle done. Um, we have this and this done. Stones are already done. These are already done. We need treated wood. So we're gonna need another crafter. Another. So let's see, I think our restricting thing is going to be that. And the only way I can think of to speed that up is to... Because uh, I think that's the only way you can get this is through there or go to the nether. But nether trips are not the funnest. Um, what am I looking for? I am looking for technium ingot, which I should have two left. I thought, or did I use them? Oh, <gasps> did I use them? No, I didn't. Because technically this should speed it up, but I didn't update the pack, so it might not even do anything. Do that. Let's see. Yeah. Huh. Don't work. So yeah, we need to update the pack for that to work. Crap. Which is my mistake. I totally forgot to do that. Maybe I'll do that between next episode. Um. But hey, we got nine more pieces of quartz. That we can just chuck in here. Cool. But pretty soon, I'm hoping we can get some stuff done. Um, there we go. And I think we don't have no more patterns either, which kind of blows, so we can't even set that up. So, let me do this, guys. Let me take a cut here. I will actually update the pack, because I think that's what that pat, that update was for, is to make sure those ink is working those. I will let this run so we can get more quartz, so we can get more quartz iron, because that's the thing that's actually handicapping us right now. Once I get that, I'll be able to make more cables because we're going to need more cables and stuff over there. Yeah. 
Quartz is our limited object, so I will be back once I can get that fixed for us. So we already got some, some automation going, so I'm pretty happy with that. Um, so bronze is on demand, so win-win. So I'll see y'all in a bit. What's up, guys? And we are back. Um, been busy. It's been about three hours. I actually ended up helping some, playing with some friends from Final Fantasy XIV. Ran some, some routine stuffs. But uh, yeah, I went and added some more machines. I think I did this one on camera. But then I added a glass and a silicone. I added the pulverizer just because I was cleaning up the corner. I was like, let's just do it. I went and made some more of these crafters. I think that's all we need. But we do need probably two of these to match. There we go. I don't think we need the sword right now. But. So, if you look at the recipe, these are added. Um, this is good. These three are added. Water is already going to be there. We need to autocraft treated wood planks, and we already did bronze, and we already did sheared bricks. Those are done over here. There's our bronze, and there's our bricks. So, if we come down here, here's where we're going to get our treated wood from. Boom. It's been running slowly. Slowly. But this is where we're going to get it from. So, if we do something like that and like that. So, arrow point into the box. That. That. And we should just be able to run this cable down right here, right? Yep, perfect. It is online. It is ready to receive. So if we come over here, we need some power cables. And I like to tell it what it's going to be pulling out just in case. I don't want it to just like willy-nilly. Um... Where am I going? Oh, this side. Uh, yeah. Boom. And whitelist. So it's only going to allow that in. Um, uh, power. Which I actually just disconnected this because I was like, yeah, we don't need it. But we do. Okay. Now, I believe we can put the ingots in here to speed them up. Yep. Cool. I also went ahead and put the augmentations components in here. So, these are a lot faster, too. So, we're overall just... just we're going, we're going big on this. All right. So, that completes you. So, technically speaking, we have all this. So, we need to make a recipe for this. Um, treated wood. Boom. Get. Uh, how do you delete it? There we go. So boom. And then we're going to delete that. Okay. Boom. Cool, cool. Cool, cool. So I think there's a monitor you can make so you can put input these things. But let's go over here and automate this one, which it has power, it has the water we need, so we just need to slap you down. There we go. Input. <gasps> I don't want it to be seen from the sky, but for now that's fine. But we're going to do that. And that should be online now. Boom. Got the water. So now technically it should craft. Um, let's see what that monitor is called. Refine. Fluid gauge. So we could store some of this fluid in digital. 
which is a thing we could do. Pattern grid. Crafting monitor. These blocks can be died. Okay, that's not. Crafting monitor. Crafting monitor. Crafting manager. I don't know the difference between those two. And their thing is just screaming at me. Oh, you could do. Oh my god, that's expensive. That's not too hard. That's fine. So we do this. Okay, so this should tell me like what's it working on. So we do this, and I need that. So it's gonna show you, I may already have the items already in, to be honest with you. Processing, processing. It's a lot of processing. I think those machines are super slow too, so that might be our handicap. So if we fly over here. See, it is working. It's just really slow. I'll speed it up a little bit. There you go. So if we go back over here. This is reduced. But if we go in here, we have the two. Perfect. So technium ingot is craftable. So we're already beat the game if you ask me. Sorry to tell you. It's in the series now play. Uh, but again. The thing that is the slowest is this quartz. It takes so long to get quartz. It's crazy. Uh, magma crucible. I want to make one of those. Okay, you might be like, what are you doing with that, Link? Well, you see. How do you look like? I yeah, got 10 of you, perfect. But if I want to use all that that's in there, we're going to have to throw some more iron in there. Like so. How much? Because what we're going to end up doing is we're actually going to end up making like two or three of these. I think three is the most we're going to need. We're going to get rid of this. And I know I built that whole building over there. I guess technically we could build this over there because this is a machine. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Um, grab some more of those. And then, need some more of those. Because what I'm hoping we can get to a point is, Do something like that. Do I have quartz? I do have some quartz. We need power cables. Got the power cables. I just need this machine here, which, as you see, it's still using up the stuff we have in here. But I do need the import thing. Which is fine. There we go. Because that will help us. And I want to use all of this that we can. Because it ain't easy. It ain't easy. All right. So while that's doing that, we need an export bus. So I think I, I'm, I will do that. I think I will go with the exporting of this rather than the one per craft. We're just gonna export it. So it's always on demand, always ready to go. Okay, so we're almost done. Beautiful. And this will be enough to make more things if I need it. 
Because we need one for redstone, we're going to need one for the glass that's in there. But then we can kind of remove this and add another lava thing if we need to. Okay, perfect. So we can actually get rid of this. And move it over here. So what I'm kind of hoping is, I mean, we could even put it on this floor if we wanted to, because it will have walls. And then we're going to have power coming in from the bottom. So we'll have it come in through the side, export out the top. Uh, yeah. We'll wrench you. Exporter. You're going to export that. And then we're going to import. And whitelist, not you, yep. And that's that. Okay. Um, water. I mean, not water, power. We'll have to tap in there somewhere. Perfect. And then we just have to run network cables somehow. Oh, I need power to the top one, don't I? Do, do, do. Trying to figure this out. Figure it out. All right. We're going to put this on the side of it. Because we can actually do covers if we want to ever make this pretty. So. Not pick it up. Okay, so that's gonna go in there. Technically, we can just do input in the back. Export bus, quartz, uh, import bus, whitelist. You and then we can just run this through here. That's why I have this spot here. If you believe me, I feel sorry for you. I don't plan that far ahead in the future. <laughs> Uh, the diorier is so real. Ugh, it's so gross. Oh, I need a lot of wire, actually. Let's go grab some more. But this will automate that stuff. Which, in return, is one less thing I have to freaking worry about. Perfect. So make 24, that's probably more than we need, but that's fine. Um, the 
only bad thing is those are all being seen. But this bad boy is roaring. And we should see it. There we go. But now that's on demand. Oh yeah. And then if we wanted to get fancy, we can do um, it already exported all my quartz. <laughs> We're screwed. Uh, I was gonna say what we could do is just do the obsidian. So obsidian is just this equals, I don't have no obsidian. But later on we can remove it because what we're gonna actually be doing is there's a miner, a tier four miner we can use to get this, so. But until we get to tier four, we need to automate the lower level stuff just to make our lives simpler. So we can do that. And again, point it down. So that's on. And then we put the import bus there. I think we might be able to snag one. Yeah, we can. Sweet. I just need to remember not to put them all in there and just hold on to these five in case I need them. All right, so import bus. Destruction core. In a putter. I almost went to put it in there. I don't know if y'all saw that. Obsidian. And we need a pattern. You wait, what did I not? Did I god dang it? Give me some iron. <laughs> I forgot to make the thing. Boom. Forgot to do this. That's a mom by in. But while that's doing that, we can boop. Tell it, oh man. Import, there we go. So now Obsidian's um, operational. So we got Obsidian, can't put the quartz in there. I will probably just craft those now. No point in holding on to them. Um, pattern, and I just got rid of that pattern, didn't I? Yep. Wait. Yep. Actually, give me one more. Neat. So we're going to need iron. There's that, and then stone brick, obsidian. I guess technically we could do that, but and then I need one more pattern. And that pattern is gonna be for stone brick. Cause we need a way to craft that right now I have those pre-made for myself so there okay you're going to receive you and you're going to receive you so theoretically
take those out. There's no point in putting those in there. Theoretically, we should be set. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. In a nutshell, this is automated. Done. I'm going to leave those there because we are going to use those. But we made a magma crucible. Done. There's a bunch of stuff we can do. Automate now. It's... It should be a lot easier. Our next thing will be making this stuff. Um, this will be the next thing we automate. Because it's still kind of a pain in the butt to fly back and forth. But we need to make gears. Plates. Invar. Um, I think I taught it how to make Invar. We already taught it Obsidian. So that's a key thing done. But it needs to learn how to make plates. Some steel. And then that's done. In bar? Nope, I didn't teach it in bar. Neat. But anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed. We're moving along in this pack. Pretty soon we'll be able to automate every step, hopefully. That's the plan, at least. Um, and there. And a smelter. There. So now that's on demand. I just need to figure out how we can make steel and plates and stuff, but we'll find out next episode because I think I already got an idea how we're going to do it. We just got to move forward with it. So I'm going to let y'all go. I'm going to let the game run because we're going to be out of quartz for a good little while until all this gets back ordered, I think. Um, because until this is full, it's just going to keep eating all the quartz. And as far as I know, that miner downstairs is the only way to get the quartz, and it's a random chance. So I'll see you on the next one, guys. Until then, stay safe. Peace.